This book says you'll be able to speak English fluently. Hi everyone, it's Scott here from That's English School. 今回は非常にシンプルなトピックには見えますが、奥が深いです。Say という動詞ですね。当たり前のように皆さん使っていると思いますが、基本的な意味はですね、言う、意見を述べる、あとは口に出す。当たり前ですよね。でもね、全く違う意味もありますよ。この動画で、say のいろんな意味を、えー、解説していきますので、一緒に学んでいきましょう。So, what do you say? We get down to business. Here is the lesson lineup. We use say when we're talking about information that is written down for us to read. We can say, the newspaper says, or it says in the newspaper. Both are commonly used, so I recommend using both patterns to add variety to your English. Key point a lot of Japanese English learners seem more comfortable using it is written. As it's almost the same way as you use it in Japanese. But it's more conversational to use the verb say. We can use it for magazines, posters, pamphlets, reports, billboards, websites, social media posts, basically anywhere where there are words for us to read. It says in the newspaper that the US president is coming to Japan. This blog post says that we should start investing in NFTs. It said in the report that sales are down 30% from last year. Look, that poster says there's a sale starting next week. When books start to talk, it can get a bit weird. When we're using special tools or instruments which give us data or information, we always use the verb say. We can use it for clocks, scales, thermometers, calculators. It's really very useful. What time does your watch say? I think mine is running a bit slow. When I got on the scales, They said I had put on three kilograms. Oh, must be broken. The thermometer in my car said the temperature outside was minus two degrees. It says that I've only got 9% power left. I've got to charge my phone. My scales don't say, they scream. <coughs> Been having a few problems with my camera. I'm gonna call customer support. Yeah, yeah. Hello, this is customer support. Bradley speaking. How may I help you? Oh, howdy. My name's Bob. My name's Bob. Hi, Bob. How can I help you? I'm having me some trouble with my camera. What's the model number? It's a Panasonic Lumix DMC FC20. Very good. And what seems to be the problem? Well, it says I'm out of battery. But I charged it up just this morning. And how long did you charge it for, Bob? About 20 minutes. It says in the instruction manual that you have to charge it for at least two hours to get a full charge. Two hours? I ain't got that kind of time. Maybe you've already noticed, but I say this one quite a lot in my videos. Let's say you're in the supermarket. Let's say a person decided to change job. Let's say your CEO is about to make a presentation. It's very common to use let's say or just say. This always goes at the beginning. Of the sentence. A lot of Japanese students use if or for example. These are great, but my advice to you 
is to use say at least now and again. Say you won the lottery. What would you do? Say your husband wanted a divorce. Would you agree? Let's say it takes an hour to get there. When should we leave? Let's say you were in an accident. Who would take care of your dog? There's one more way that you can use let's say. It's often used for deciding times. Let's say around seven. Of course, you can use it for days and dates, but it feels like it could change in the future. Let's say Wednesday. Let's say the 24th. So, if you're putting together a really important schedule, just remember, let's say doesn't sound like it's completely fixed. This is an interesting one. We can also use say for a kind of gambling. Now, we don't use say in this way for formal gambling operations such as horse racing. It's more used between friends for a bit of fun. It doesn't always have to be about money either. How do we use it? Well, first, you state the amount of money. Then, you put in says. And finally, you put in your prediction. 1,000 yen says he won't ask her out on a date. 500 yen says you can't sink that putt for a birdie. A steak dinner says you'll stop going to the gym after a month. 20 quid says Manchester City will win the Premier League. 10,000 yen says I can draw a perfect circle on the whiteboard. Ready? Not bad. 10,000 yen, please. Thank you very much. <laughs> so, do you think I should get a new battery? Well, they don't last forever. Does it say how often we should replace them? Hang on. It says every two years. Hot diggity dog. I've had mine for five years. Perhaps you might like to buy a new one. <laughs> Say, are you British? Yes, I am. I just love your accent. Hey, Barbara Jane, get over here. Hey, say something British to my wife. Fish and chips. Fish and chips. That's so nice. 20 bucks says you can't do an American accent. Okay, I'll give it a try. My name's Bob. I'm an American. Well, I'll be darned. I'm going to give you a Japanese sentence and I want you to change it into some beautiful English, of course, using say. Okay, here goes. Today's was a little bit difficult to read. Yeah. Please give me the benefit of the doubt with this one. Okay. Tatueba, Sekaiju. どこへでも行けるとしたらどこに行きますか？ムザ、okay. Uh, so put your answer down in the comments below, and I'll check them ASAP. Good luck. The next thing for you to watch is this playlist. This is the Ego King Q Project series. There are loads of really useful videos talking about a very detailed point in each topic. Okay, I'll see you over there. Let's go.